Good day, everyone. In the news now is an article that follows on many articles that many of you might have seen during the week. And I want to really highlight this specific person for uh, what he did for freedom. And I'm not saying that you should go and repeat what he's done. But uh, what I am saying is that he stood up for what he believed was right and he faced the consequences. He was willing to face the consequences. But um, what follows later in the article um, is what is really sad. And, and I would like to focus on that. And this is the man that was booted off the FlySafe Air flight. And he was now identified as a top South African Olympian. And I want to make him famous amongst all my uh, followers and subscribers. The, uh, and this news is from the South African.com. And the sub headline reads A passenger ejected from a fly safe flight earlier this week has been identified as top South African runner Stephen Mokoka. And Stephen Mokoka will probably now become a hero amongst you. And I want you to go and look him up, see his track record, and see uh, what he's achieved in his athletics career, which has obviously been ruined by this whole COVID 19 lockdown situation. And, um, Let's get into the article and then get to the very disturbing part at the end. The passenger ejected from a fly safe flight earlier this week has been identified as top South African runner Stephen Mokoka. Mokoka was escorted off the plane set to leave Cape Town for Johannesburg for not wearing a mask. Mokoka was removed from the plane by the flight crew, but managed to cause considerable disruption before being hauled off. So obviously he wasn't happy with the status quo. And like I said, I'm not saying that you should respond in this way at all. What I am saying is that he stood up for what he believed in. Um, I didn't see the video of what actually transpired. I'm not uh, um, giving my idea on whether it was right, wrong, how he behaved or how anyone else behaved. He was captured on video swearing at staff and other passengers who cheered when he was ultimately left behind. So the staff and the passengers on the plane cheered when he was left behind. Think about what this means. In my video, when I spoke about Israel and these new green passports, which are actually vaccination passports, okay? They like to use the word green, the same as green energy, the same as green philosophy, ideology, etc. They call it the green passports. And now these people are just like in Israel where people are separated into two camps. Now this person is ejected from the plane. There was no sympathy shown for him. What actually happened is the people cheered because he was thrown off. And this is what we need to deal with and we need to build that critical mass so that the sheep that cheer for something like that will shiver in their boots. Because the majority of us Rational thinking people will be able to make them think otherwise and make how they behave unpopular. Uh, so the faster we can get this movement going, the better. Fly safe's policy is that all passengers wear masks for the duration of their time on the airline's aircrafts in a bid to reduce the risk of spreading COVID-19. Stephen McCorker is four-time winner of the Shanghai Marathon between 2013 and 2017. So he won all of those years, and that's a significant uh, accolade to have under the belt. He has completed in the marathon at the 2012 Lo uh, London Olympics and in the 10,000 meters at the 2016 Rio Games. This is where, um, where we had a new world record in the uh, 400 meters with Wade van Nieker. So he is a well-accomplished athlete. And then they have a video underneath the link of how the people are trying to throw him off the plane and people's behavior. The link to this article is in the description below the video. And if you have not subscribed yet to this channel, please subscribe and click the bell icon so you can receive notifications for videos. This movement is growing on the ground. No one can stop it. And we need common sense to start prevailing so that people like... Um, Stephen Mokoka can be vindicated for how they felt about the fact that he was forced to wear a mask on an aircraft. I would like to vindicate his action. I'm not, uh, I'm not saying or his feelings. I want to vindicate his feelings, uh, his action, 
Uh, you can have a look at it. He's obviously very upset. He obviously supports how we think. And I want you to really support this man for standing up for what he believes in. We need more people to do this. I'm not saying that you should fight anyone or anything, but it's very important that you make it known how you feel. And it's, 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 it's important that the more of us that there are that makes our feelings known, the easier it is to influence the people around us. And this is what we need to do at this time. Many of the people are just sheeple that just follow the masses because the mainstream media reaches many people and we are creating the alternative media. And that's why I want you to share this video and click the like button so it can be shown to more people out there. We have now added a new venue into our schedule. We will be visiting Dundee after Howick before we move on to Freya. And I will give further details with regards to that tomorrow. Thank you very much. Till the next video.